Don't know why There's no sun up in the sky Stormy weather Hello my dudes Welcome back to another vlog I hope you like this setup I've never done this setup before even though I'm sitting at the same place I was when I ended my last vlog still have my retainers in and also i have a canker sore like right here now so talking is also painful for me now that's why i'm kind of talking weirdly <laughs> welcome to my pink lair where i woke up feeling sick today like just a cold flu kind of vibe like my body is aching and i don't have much energy so i'm really grateful that i'm on my break right now and also that my job is so flexible because i was going to work today and get next week's article done it's a thursday by the way but i just knew that if i work today i would be forcing myself to do so and that i would probably feel even more sick in the coming days so i'm like no today is for relaxing so that's what we're doing yeah i don't really have anything pressing i need to get done in the next week so it's a, it's gonna be a more chill vlog uh and i am reading anne of green gables i started it a few nights ago and it's so cute so far i'm reading it on my phone Anne of Green Gables is by Ellen Montgomery, a Canadian author. I was planning on reading it this summer because it's just a cute cottage quarry vibe. Um, if you didn't know, Anne of Green Gables follows this little girl, 11 years old, skinny, redheaded, talks so much, has a wide imagination um she's a big dreamer and just like such a cute child she's an orphan Anne is from nova nova scotia and marilla and matthew cuthbert wants to adopt a boy from the orphanage but then the they send over a girl and matthew ugh I love Matthew. He's like this man of few words, quiet and shy, and keeps to himself, but he realizes that he really likes this little girl, like she's so cute, and she feels more comfortable in the company of people who will do all the talking by themselves, and he's not required to like make conversation but marilla on the other hand does not like this girl she's like i wanted a boy and what is this girl she talks too much she doesn't be behave like a proper girl should so right now i'm not really liking marilla and then they break it to and that they're gonna have to send her back because they want a boy and she is so sad, understandably, because on the ride to their house in Green Gables, she's already fallen in love with all the trees there, the apple trees, cherry blossoms, the cherry trees, the meadows, everything. Like, it's just heaven to her she's never seen anything like it so right now she's really sad and matthew still wants her but marilla's like no we're gonna we're going back today to talk to mrs spencer who's in charge of the orphanage and find out what's going on so that's where i'm at right now uh, but obviously we all know they're gonna end up keeping her because it's literally called Anne of Green Gables, and it's a whole series, so it's gonna be great. I'm enjoying it a lot already, and I think this will end up being a great read. Since my man and I ain't together, it keeps raining all. Life 
is bare Gloom and misery everywhere Stormy weather I just can't get my poor It's two days later, I think. Yeah, um, it is Saturday, and if you hear some louder background noise, it's just my AC. I had to turn it on. It's actually been a bit cooler for the past two days. Like, I could sleep without AC on, but in the daytime, it's still pretty hot. And my canker sore is better, but it still hurts. It was so bad yesterday. So, I'm still gonna be talking weird. <laughs> yesterday, we actually ended up going out. But before that, I just started my article for next week. Because I didn't feel sick anymore and I always have a need to complete something ahead of time in order to actually be able to function and feel good. <laughs> so that's what I did and I got a good chunk done. I'm not done yet but I will finish that right after this clip. And then at noon Unreal Unearth came out. This meme has been me for the past eight months, and it will still be that way, I can assure you. Uh, if you follow me on Instagram, I have already basically turned my stories into a fan account for a hosier. The album was beautiful, I only got a chance to listen to it all the way through one time as I was getting ready to go out but oh my gosh and I've just been on tumblr seeing all the posts about it and this morning I watched a amazon music live stream on twitch with hosier which was so fun and getting to talk to my friend about it that was so exciting <laughs> I was not expecting son of nyx it was transcendental, like, magic, pure magic. I can't wait to just listen to everything again and again and again. It was a great afternoon, and then we went out. We just went to the nearby ancient village, with, which I have vlogged before. 
maybe twice i know i did it at least once in one of my previous vlogs we just walked there we had dinner and now it is saturday had a fun slow morning i showered as well because i didn't wash my hair last night because we got home late and i was so tired now i will just try to finish my article i'm sure i can get it done this afternoon and then i'll just chill because i'm going out again tomorrow to the orthodontist to get even more pressure on my teeth um, I explained it in my last vlog. Now let's talk about Anne of Green Gables. I have read it a bit more and I am 27% of the way through now. So I think last time we ended at Anne thinking that Marilla and Matthew are going to send her away to replace her with an orphan boy. But of course they ended up keeping her and she's still getting acclimated to her life there. She has, according to them, a big temper and she doesn't behave like a well-behaved child <laughs> because obviously no one really taught her before and she's got this big fiery personality. Um, she's like learning how to pray. <laughs> learning how to just be a person in polite society and you know back then it was very suffocating suffocative because all the norms are just so rigid like she was on her way to sunday school and she had this hat on and she she went by herself and she saw this field of beautiful buttercups and wild roses so she picked some and put them in her hat to decorate because she loves to romanticize everything she likes everything to look pretty and then she showed up at the sunday school and everyone thought she was a freak simply for decorating her hat with flowers so yeah everything everyone thinks she's really weird which is sad but now she's about to go to a neighbor's house to meet one of the neighbor's daughters called Diana Barry and she really hopes Diana will be her best friend, her bosom friend and we'll see what happens Old self together Keeps raining all the time Listen, That day we read no more that's a nice way of saying it. it's kind of the Netflix and chill of the medieval sort of uh, period, I suppose. At this point. When you went away, the blues walked in and met me. If he stays away, all the rocky. Oh, the sun blinded me. <laughs> <laughs> will get me all i do is pray that the lord above will let me walk in the sun once more oh no can't go on <laughs> everything i have is gone Stormy weather. I can get my poor old self together. It keeps raining all the time. All the time. <laughs> It's been a few days, but I'm here to do another reading update. I have a new pair of retainers in, so still have my lisp and everything. I didn't film yesterday 
a lot because I was just working. I wanted to get my article for next week out of the way so that I could relax more for the rest of my break. School starts again next Thursday and today is Wednesday. So I have about a week left, but I have been really enjoying Anne of Green Gables. Anne is so cute. Like, usually I'm so annoyed when people cannot stop talking. Like, they just go on and on and on. But with Anne, she has such an interesting mind and she's wise beyond her years. And it's just the cutest thing. All her classmates really like her, which I thought was so sweet because I kind of felt like she might be bullied a bit because she was so particular. But yeah, I'm glad for that. And obviously there's all the the little rivalries with Gilbert Blythe, who I only know about because my sister watched Anne with an E, which is a TV show inspired by Anne of Green Gables. So Anne now has a best friend called Diana, and they're just so cute together. I think it's so interesting how female friendships used to be written as well. Like, they're so queer-coded. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if anyone else feels that way. Stop it now. I already you stop. Do some like wall ones later. Yeah. <laughs> should have done this more often but I just figured out how cool it would be if I put the my plant light closer because today my sister and I did a photo shoot that she wants to do because she's a photographer so yeah she always has these cool concepts um we spent like an hour taking pictures which are up here on the screen just some of them I think I'm gonna end the vlog here because I have not been reading a lot and I don't want to drag this on too long. I barely filmed today because I didn't do much. I just slept in and I made ice cream, but it's my first time doing it so I didn't film it. Maybe I will do that the next time I make it in a future vlog. I hope this vlog was fun to watch. I didn't really do much in this vlog and I haven't read much of Anne with an E since the last time I updated, but I did just want to talk about how much Anne likes everything to be romantic. Um, like everything's either romantic or unromantic because for a while she couldn't play with her best friend Diana for reasons I will not get into right now. But um, when her adoptive mother told her that she can play with her again, it was right after she had dinner and she was like, Oh, please, Marilla, may I go now without washing my dishes? I'll wash them when I come back, because right now, I cannot think of anything more unromantic than dishwashing. And I was like, <laughs> that is so cute. And is so cute. And yeah, I know I keep saying that, but I don't know. I wasn't really expecting to do any literary criticism of Anne of Green Gables. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vlog and all my...
cozy little setups. I think I definitely want to do that more in my upcoming vlogs. And I will see you next time.